welcome back. Now let's go back out to New York City to the 2009 BMI Urban Awards, where they're paying tribute to George Clinton with live performances from CeeLo, Dallas Austin, and George Clinton himself. Let's take a look. Wow, could you believe all those legends on one stage? Those were some great, great performances. Now, a few days ago, I had a chance to go one on one right here in the world famous Circle House Studios with Caribbean soca multi platinum artist Kevin Little. In fact, he was so big, he had a hit song called Turn Me On. Well, we talked about a lot of things music and what was it like to have that first big hit. And here's what he had to say. I've been listening to your music for a long time. We've got a lot of mutual friends. By the way, this guy right here wrote the track, which is the number was the number one track, uh, Turn Me On, was that what it's called? Yeah, 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 number one track across the world at one time and um, uh, sold me platinum. You know, that like, that puts like you on about, the top. Like about three million records worldwide. And, you know, so I mean, I'm, I'm, I'm still doing pretty well, you know, and um, I, I, I mean, the royalties and publishing you know, are still coming in. Well, yeah, <laughs> the bills, man. yeah, and and now I'm, I'm actually, I have my own label. I'm no longer with Atlantic Records. I have my own little in independent thing going on. I have a label called Tarakon Records, and um, you know, I'm doing a lot of different things around the place. I'm, I'm from the island of Saint Vincent and the Grenadines. So the people who don't know, so big up the whole West Indies, massive. Big up the whole Caribbean in general, because you know, without the Caribbean region. I would not have been able to make it, you know, because my music crossed over into Jamaica, Trinidad, and then got to the world. I want to know about the crossover aspect of, I'm going to say, dancehall, reggae, soca music. You know, I know Shaggy did it, and, and Sean Paul did it, and you're doing it, you know, obviously now. Where do you see this type of sound, this type of music going on pop radio as we're coming into, like, the new, you know, the, the new millennium? Well, yo, you know exactly what you see being presented to you from people like me um, and um, and Sean Kingston, for instance, is is one of the, the full examples of where the, the Caribbean music is gonna go. When you got signed by Atlantic Records, I mean, your first big label, man. I mean, what was that like? Well, that was incredible. I mean, there was a lot of good and a lot of bad that came with it, you know what I'm saying? But the good far outweighed the bad in the sense that I've learned a lot. You know, it was a learning experience. I learned what the business is and I learned that it is a very serious business. It ain't no joke. It was the last hit. <laughs> yeah, you know what I'm saying? It's very important for you to think about longevity when you get into the music business, which is one of the key things that I learned. Now, you have that um, that high-pitched voice. Yeah. I mean, which is, uh, you know, it's, it's kind of rare in music. It's hard to do. You know, Michael Jackson has has it, you know, and um, so other artists have it. To have that high-pitched voice, it's, it's a rarity. Is that an asset in the music business? I mean, do people want to work with you because you have that voice? 
Well, yeah, you know, I mean, I, I think that once you have the ability to flex your voice on all different levels, people will want to work with you. <laughs> Let me hold you, girl, caress my body. You got me going crazy. Yeah, turn me on, turn me on. Yeah, yeah. I'm honored to have you on the show. Yeah. I mean, I wish you nothing but success, as they say in the islands. Much respect to you, you know, and um, you're going to just keep on making great hits and, you know, making tons of great music. We got to tell them about my new single, though. I got I got a brand new single. It's called Love Come On Out. It's already on mainstream radio. You know what I'm saying? So look out for it. Call in your local radio station. Request my new song, ladies and gentlemen. You know what I'm saying? Because, guys, you know what I'm saying? Wherever the ladies go, you got to go in any case. So you better, you know what I'm saying? Sure. <laughs> yeah. Sure. Well, Kevin, keep doing your thing. This is my Mike Sherman, I'm down here at the Circle House Studios in Studio A with Caribbean Soca, multi-platinum sensation, Kevin Little. We'll be right back. Don't touch that remote, because up next, we're bringing you an exclusive couture fashion show from designer clothes. We'll be right back. 